Good evening. Tiene el micrófono apagado. Thank you, Rose. Thank you. Okay. So let me know if you can see my screen. No sé si podemos ver my screen, guys. Can you see it? Yes. Okay. Yes, teacher. Okay. Good evening, guys. Good to see you, everybody. Thank you so much for coming early, right? And punctual. Okay. Let's go to the lesson that we have for today. And uh, let's have a review first, right? What do you remember? Yes, Rose. Mm -hmm. este, es de la plataforma. Dígame. Mm -hmm. Que siempre he tenido el problema de que cuando escribo siempre me salen malas las clases. Mm. Este, mm -hmm. O sea, las escribo de una y mil maneras para ver si es algún problema, pero igual me pasé en el módulo anterior y siempre me salen malas. No, no entiendo. Por qué. Usted fue la que mandó este, la imagen en el grupo. Sí, la mandé. Veamos. ¿Qué sabe a veces lo que pasa? Que puede ser que sea la primera letra que es mayúscula. Ahí ah, veo que lo puso y también las comas. Ah, ok. Por ejemplo, donde dice no, mayúscula, coma, I am not. Si no le funciona de, de la forma larga como usted la ha puesto, haga de la forma corta. Ok. Ajá. Y también el punto, ¿verdad? Ah. O sea, acá lo que le pasó fue que utilizó todo mayúscula. Ah, ok. Ajá. Podemos tratar, como recuerde que es de la forma larga y de la forma corta. Podemos intentar las dos. Okay. Thank you. Okay. ok. So, let's have a review, guys. Good to see you, everybody. And uh, what do you remember from the previous class? ¿Qué es lo que recuerdan? From the previous class. What do you remember, uh, Oscar, in your case? What do you remember from the previous class? What did we study? Mm -hmm. Oscar? ¿Qué estudiamos? What did we study last time? What about you, Manuel Romero? What do you remember? ¿Qué estudiamos? What did we study? Uh, readings for uh, from around the world. Yes, that's right. About the readings, right? That there are some ways people greet each other. Okay, thank you, Manuel. Uh, what else? Uh, let's see, Janet. What else did we study? What else did we study, uh, Janet? Mm -hmm. Good evening. I didn't come on Friday. Okay, you didn't come, but what about on Wednesday, Thursday? Do you remember what it was study? Lo que estudiamos estos días? The, the possessive. Yes, right, the possessive adjectives. Very good. Thank you, Janet. Okay, ¿cuáles son los possessive? Which are the possessives? The rose, which are the possessives? My. Okay, we have my, uh -huh. another, your, uh -huh. his, his uh -huh. her, her, it, its, okay, uh -huh. our, our, okay, our, there, uh -huh. and there, right. Thank you, Rose. Okay, cuando utilizamos, when do we use, por ejemplo, his? Eh, Araceli, when do we use his? Uh -huh. ¿Para qué sujeto utilizamos his? Uh -huh. ¿Para? ¿Para cuál sujeto utilizamos his? Cuando tenemos he, when we have he. ¿Y cuándo utilizamos her? ¿Con qué sujeto? She. She. Y cuando utilizamos, por ejemplo, our, ¿con cuál sujeto? We. Con we. And uh, the other ones, maybe we know them, right? We with it, they, and with. Okay, 
so far so good guys with the topics so far so good okay so let's go with the topics for today y solo se les un reminder right se les un recordatorio de las fechas para completar en la plataforma tenemos que de las del 30 from march 30 to April 4, tenemos que terminar la sección 1 and 2. Ok, 1 and 2. Then, de April 5 to 8, vamos a terminar sección 3 y el examen medio. Ok. Luego tenemos del 18, from April 18 to 21st, sería la sección 4. Y del 22, 22, 27, tenemos que terminar la sección 5 en final test. Ok, para que tengamos en cuenta las fechas. Ok, no sé si hay dudas. Either this, porque esas fechas son las que se ingresan las notas. Ok, so let's go with the topic that we have for today. So we have the six popular part-time jobs in the USA. Okay, we have babysitter, we have fitness instructor, we have office assistant, the sales associate, we have the social media assistant and tutor. Okay, in your case, Janet, which jobs are easy, difficult, Exciting, boring. ¿Cuáles considera usted? That are easy, por ejemplo, from these ones. Which ones, Janet? ¿Mm? ¿Cuáles serán easy? Which jobs, qué trabajos son fáciles, are easy? Mm -hmm. Okay, what about uh, you, Araceli? Which jobs are easy? For me, babysitter. Babysitter? Mm. I like your the you like you like oh you like children. That's why. That's why. There is a phrase, hay una frase que dice que si el trabajo se le gusta, usted lo, lo, no lo va a sentir difícil, right? And that's right. If you like your job, you're going to feel it easy. Okay. What about in your case, Rose? Which job is difficult for you? Can be these ones or others. ¿Qué otros trabajos? Mm -hmm. Rose, which jobs are difficult, let's say? Mm -hmm. Uh, difficult. Uh -huh. Baby sister. Baby sitter? Okay. Yes. <laughs> okay, I guess it is <laughs> for your experience, right? Baby sitter. Okay, what about you, Manuel? Which jobs are exciting? Uh -huh. ¿Cuáles son en la que trabajos en la kids you move? Exciting. Sales associate. Really? Sales associate? It can be, right? Depending on the person, depending on the person, right? About sales associate. Right? Okay. And boring, Oscar? What do you think the jobs that are boring? I think, I think that the uh... Yo, boring, mm -hmm. it could be, how do you say, uh, porter, portero, I don't know, do you say? It is like the ones that, um, let me check, I don't remember, let me check. Okay, is there any other? Algún otro? Let's see. Oh, no. Like keeper. Psychology. Psychologist? That is yeah. it boring? I I think that this joke could be 
so boring because I I I have to air the all problem from all people. I don't know. Deal, right? To deal, deal, yeah. deal or handle, right? Yes, with with problems from others. It can be even doctors, right? Because those doctors they have a difficult job. Or nurses too, right? When I when I said portero, I mean the uh, portero, but the apartment <laughs> hangout. Yeah. But football. <laughs> not not soccer. Not soccer. Okay. No. Yes. Maybe like a police or something like from the from the neighborhood. Maybe right. But they have to take care of the persons. Yeah, I found the word, but I, I'm not quite sure if that's the one that we are looking for. Okay, so yes, right. These jobs can be difficult. They can be easy or even they can be boring. Okay, that's good, right? So let's have a look of the next slide. And uh, we have here some vocabulary, right? Okay, let's see which jobs are ideal for office work. Can you help me, uh, Rose? Which jobs, que trabajos we can have uh, when we are in the office, let's say? We have accountant, right? Yes, they have to be in the office, but nowadays it's different. Receptionist. We have uh, which ones? Which ones? I'm sorry, Rose. Receptionist. Oh, yes, receptionist, right. Receptionist. Mm -hmm. Any other? Web design, designer. Oh, web designer, yes, that's right. Web designer. Mm -hmm. Any other? Server. Mm -hmm. It can be right, but let's add that in the full service. Okay, Rose. Okay, what what is another uh, job, Rose? Aparte de estos for office work. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué otro? What is another job we can add in that category? In the office, Robert. Yeah, in the office. Maybe lawyers. What about lawyers? Los abogados? Yes. Can be, right? Mm -hmm. A secretary, don't you think? Yes. Secretary. Office assistant. Office assistant. Office assistant. Okay, that's right. M managers. Managers too, right? Managers, yes, sometimes they are in the office and some others they don't, but yeah, it can be. Okay, what about food service? What can we find, for example, in the food service? Can you help me? Uh, maybe, Henry, can you help me with the food service? Uh, cashier. Okay, we have the cashier. Mm -hmm. Any oh, other? Um... Mm -hmm. We have chef, right? No, sin que eres cantante, perdón. And the guía, tour gear. It can be, right? Mm -hmm. It can be. The dishwasher can be, right? Dish. Washer, what about that one? Los que lavan los platos, dishwashers. Any other? Oh, what about server? Then the ones that attend, right, server. ¿Qué más podemos encontrar? What else can we find in food services, Henry? Is there any other job that applies to food services? Bullet parking. I'm sorry? Sorry, one night. Ballet parking. Oh, the ballet the, for the parking, right? 
Yes, the person that it is like taking care for the parking. Carry on service. I'm sorry. Carry on service. Carry. Oh yeah, right for sure. Carry on service, right? Wants to take your food, right? Okay. What about the travel industry? What can we find? Delivery. Oh, delivery too, right? Yes, that's right. Okay, and what about the travel industry? Which jobs can we find in travel industry? Tour, tour guide. guide. Yeah, that's right. We have the tour guide. What else can we find? Mm -hmm. We have tour guides. What about the pilots, right? Pilot. Mm -hmm. We have pilots. Do we have the motor taxi drivers? That's right. Tourists? Tourists too, right? We can find tourists. There's some more art. What about entertainment? Entertainment business. What words can we use for jobs? That be drink. Drink? Drink? Do you mean drink? Drink. 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 See the leaders. Uh, an actor. I, I didn't get it. Can you repeat it, please, guys? Singer. Oh, singer. Okay, singers. Mm -hmm. What is? Actor. Actors. Vocalist. Yes. Vocalist. Vocalist. Like this. Drunkers. <laughs> <laughs> it can be right. It can be. They can be drunk. <laughs> For sure. That's right, drunkers, right? Yeah, sure. Okay, so this is part of the vocabulary, right, that we can find in the jobs. Okay, let's move on to the next part. And in today's lessons, we are going to learn about simple press. And remember that I have been telling you, review the simple press and because it is important, right? Okay. So, uh, cuando utilizamos, when do we use the simple present? Who can tell me when do we use the simple present? Cuando lo utilizamos? The simple present. Hmm? Cuando lo utilizamos? Okay. In the routines. We use it, yes, for routines. Or telling, for example, general or habits. Or habits, general truths too, habits. Mainly this type of routines, right? Okay, so we have the structure. Tenemos la estructura. So important this structure, right? Si no aprendemos eh, la estructura, posiblemente más adelante. Vamos a cometer these mistakes that I want you to avoid. Okay, what is the structure, la estructura, right? Tenemos entonces la estructura, la forma, en oraciones afirmativas, affirmative sentences. When we have, for example, I, you, we, y they, the verb keeps the same, right? Stays the same. Se mantiene igual, no cambia nada. But when we have he, she, and it, the verb changes. We add S or ES, or depending on the verb, we are going to change part of it. So, for example, we have uh, sentences. Tenemos las oraciones. I am or am a student. Estamos utilizando el verbo to be. Ahí este no ya lo estudiamos. Vamos a take it out. Pero si yo tengo, por ejemplo, have, I have a part-time job. Si yo quiero decir, ella tiene. How can I say that, guys? Ella tiene. How can I say that? Ella tiene un part-time. That's right. Vamos a utilizar. It has, right. That's a part-time job. Recordemos que cuando es he, she, or it, vamos a utilizar. Okay, we have it. 
So we have, for example, tenemos también que le vamos a agregar ese al verbo, cuando sea he, she, or it. Y en algunos casos les mencionaba that it's going to change, for example. Tenemos el verbo leave, leaves, right? Esto es para he, she, it. We have the verb miss, misses. We have carry, carries. Do, does. Go, goes. Buy, buys. Search, searches. Study, studies. Y el que ya vimos, have or has. Tenemos acá las reglas, right? When to change or drop letters. Ok, as a question, como pregunta, tenemos, vamos a utilizar el do, we're going to use do. When we have I, you, we, they. And thus, when we have he, she, and meet. Ok, do you have questions? So far? So far, no. so good? No. Ok, very good. Then, right, estamos bien. No questions, guys? No. Tenemos entonces the negatives, right? Remember that when we have I, you, we, they, we have to use do not or don't. When we have he, she, or it, doesn't or does not. Remember that the verb we're not going to add S. It, it stands the same. Y la pregunta, right? The question that we have studied. We have the short answer. Yes, I do. Yes, he or she does. Or if it is negative, do, uh, do, we have to use do not write, don't. No, I don't. Or in the case that in that this he, she, or it, no, she doesn't. Okay, questions? Or are we good? Mm -hmm. No questions? Okay, guys, so let's practice. Let's practice with some exercise. Okay, can you help me with the first one? Maybe Suleyma, can you help me with the first one? We have to use the simple present, right? So we have, what do you do? I'm a full-time student. I study the piano. And ¿qué vamos a utilizar acá? Mm -hmm. What are we going to use? Mm -hmm. Yes, Suleyma? Um, what do you... Mm -hmm. What do you... What do you... Mm -hmm. uh, Go to the school. Oh, in that case, we're going to change it. When, right? When do you go? When, right? When do you go to school? Mm -hmm. Or where, right? Where? I'll use where. In this case, where? Because this is a place, in right? the Aswar is the Brooklyn School of Music. Where do you? That's right. Okay, so we have I go, right? I go to the music. Wow, okay, continue, Suleyma. Mm -hmm. How do you like your class? How, okay, how? Mm -hmm. And then we have I. I like them a lot. Okay, I like or I love them, right? I like them. Okay, what about number two, guys? What Tanya do? What is the word that is missing? Mm -hmm. Or the auxiliary, right? Does. Does. Right? What does Tanya do? She's a teacher. She. Mm -hmm. 
She's a teacher and uh, she teaches. She teaches, right? Teaches an art class at a school in Denver. What about Ryan? Where? Is where where does, does he work? Where does right? Where does he work? He he works works. That's right. He works for a big computer. And uh, what about the next one? What what right? What he's a web designer. He He, is. He, he does. does. He does. He does. He does. He does. He fantastic website. Okay. Do you have questions about the simple past, the simple present, guys? Questions? No. No. Okay. So let's move on to your practices, right? Remember that here, what matters is that you practice and uh, have a better understanding right of this of this part okay we're going to have this part this practice estudiamos we studied the affirmative the negatives the short answers so we're going to apply all of this in this exercise so in the first part it says look at mark's timetable complete the sentence with the affirmative form of the verb in brackets, right? So we are going to conjugate the verbs we have in brackets based, based on the information that he has, right? Okay. So for example, Mark goes to school five days a week. So we see that he goes five days, right? Monday, Tuesday, Thursday. So you have to conjugate based on the information you have here. In the second part, we are going to do it, but in negative. Okay, take care with the subject. Tengamos cuidado con el sujeto because we are going to do it in negative form. The last part, you are going to do questions using do or does and giving short answers. Okay, let me know if you have questions about the activity. No questions? Okay, no. Okay, so let's move on to the breakout rooms. I'm gonna give you, let's say like, like 10 to 15 minutes for you to have enough time and uh, for sure right, you can practice. So I'm going to be sharing this in the break in the, in the group of WhatsApp. So you can have a look there. You can find the picture, okay? And just share. Here it is.
letter letter H. Mark school. Uh, Mark school. The In the letter B, guys, ladies, do you have questions? No questions? Not yet. Not yet. Okay, I'll let you work. Let me know if you have questions. For no me. Ay, ya terminó, pero no le hay okay. lógica tanto a esa, ¿verdad? No, todavía no, sí, no yet, el sí. Uh, do you have questions? Do you have questions? Any... Yes, teacher. Yes. Um, hmm. For example, uh, literal E. Le, letter E in the first part. Ajá, yes. uh -huh. hmm. on Tuesday between 11.30 and 30. Perry marks class. Does. Does sport. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Does sport, right? Mm, pero intento encontrarle la lógica. <laughs> Perdón. La clase de, de Mark hace deporte. Mm, es como una clase de educación. Mm -hmm. de educación. <laughs> That's right. Mm -hmm. Ok. Mm -hmm. Ok. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Thank any you. other any other question? No. 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 Thanks. Okay. okay, I let you work, guys. Okay. Thank you.
Hello, Araceli. Uh, are you, were you working or did you have problems? Oh, sí, tengo problemas con mi computadora ahorita. Uh, let me just voy a try. Reiniciar, voy a okay. sí. Solo lo voy a, voy a unirle al grupo donde estaba, oiga. Ok, déjenme ver si lo puedo cambiar. Can you try, Araceli, please? Tenemos que dar a unirnos, ok, Araceli? Sí. No, 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 no. Le, le aparece un, un cuadrito donde dice unirse. Eh, sure. guys, do you have questions? Mm. We have a lot of questions. <laughs> tell me, tell me what your questions are. Mm -hmm. Which ones? Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, we have the we have a question in the letter F and the second second sentence letter F and letter F. We'll say mark. Mm -hmm. Mark, but the, the verb is how. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I we don't know how to create the. We it don't. must be in negative, right? Yeah. Okay. So what do we, what auxiliary do we use when we are talking about he? Has. Mar has not. No, no, but it has to be negative. Does, doesn't. Mm -hmm. Doesn't. Very good. And then Mar doesn't. doesn't have. Doesn't have. That's it. That's it. That's it. Yeah. Okay. Thanks. Doesn't have. Okay. Any other question? Mm, no. Okay, okay, perfect. I let you work, guys. Let me know if you have questions, okay? Rose, did you finish, Rose, or did you have problems? Hello, Rose. Yes, I finished. You finished. Okay, perfect. Let me just, okay, let me just end the meeting. And what about Janet? Did Janet finish? ¿Y Janet? ¿Terminó Janet? Yes. Okay, okay. Let me just end the meeting. So we can compare the answers, okay? Okay, let's start. Let me just share the my screen. Okay, so can you uh, share with me your answers, Rose, in the first part? Let's try to answer the first part. What do you have? Tell me. Letter B, C, and so on. What? Okay, we have goals mm -hmm. on Mondays, the classes. Yes. Mm -hmm. On Mondays, the classes. Uh, start. Start, right, sin la S, because it is plural. Porque estamos hablando about the classes, right? Okay, continue, Rose, please. Sería on Thursday, Mark. Mm -hmm. Mark, uh -huh. uh, finish. Okay. Finish. Mm -hmm. finish, finishes, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Continue. On Tuesdays? Tuesday, between 11.30 and 13. 
30 more class has, no, perdón, da, das. Das, that's right, das. Okay, continue, please. Mark. Mark has. Perfect, Mark has. Mm -hmm. And then? Mark study. Study or studies? Studies. Mm -hmm. Continue. At my school, that pupils study. Study or studies? Study. Study, muy bien, porque es plural, right? Pupils. Okay, thank you, Rose, excellent. Okay, can you help me with the second part, maybe? Uh, Oscar, can you help me with the second part? About negatives, these are negatives, remember. Oscar. Okay, can you help me maybe uh, Elsie Santos, can you help me with part two negatives? Okay, teacher. Um I have a question about the the sentence Larry C part and part two. Letter C. Mm -hmm. uh, on Mondays, the classes start. Is a start. The oh, Monday is on like. On Mondays, it. the classes start. Okay, we have the subject. We have the subject. Classes. Mm -hmm. It is plural. Ah, uh, okay. When the word is plural. Mm -hmm. You won't add the letter S only if it is singular. It is going to oh, be okay. It's like a, a equal day. Mm -hmm. If it is singular, mm, okay. right? If it is singular. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Okay. Um, part number two, mm -hmm. letter D. Mm -hmm. He goes negative, right? Ah, uh, doesn't go. Yeah, doesn't. Doesn't go oh, to perfect. school on Wednesday or Friday afternoon. Okay, continue, please. Letter C. Mm -hmm. On Wednesdays, oh no, Wednesday, the mm -hmm. classes doesn't start. I have a doubt. I think we we can change that. Remember In this case, on Wednesday, the class classes. Oh yes, <laughs> it is similar case. Yeah, it is okay. similar. Don't exactly start. don't <laughs> don't start. Okay. It I must. changed the in my, in my mind. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, change, right? Okay, let's continue. Yes. Uh, letter D, mm -hmm. on Friday, Mark. On Fridays, Mark. Um, doesn't. That's right. Or you are talking, doesn't right? finish. Doesn't finish. That's right. Cool. Continue. Uh, 17. Okay, Mark, Mark's class um, doesn't, that because it's the plural, no? It is singular. No, no Mark. It's singular, it's class. Mm -hmm. Okay, that does, doesn't mm -hmm. do. Mm -hmm. Doesn't do. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, little F. Mm -hmm. Mark, Mark doesn't have an English class of Thursday. That's right. Thursday. Thursday. Mm -hmm. Continue. Thursday. Lergi Mark doesn't mm -hmm. study Chinese. That's right. And the last one. At Mark's school, the pupils uh, does. No, do, don't study. D, 
because yeah. the is equal day. It is for plural, right? That's right. Okay. okay. Perfect, Elsie. Congratulations. Perfect. That is that Thank is the analysis, you. right? That we have to do. If we have plural, we are going to use don't, right? And we are not going to add s or e. Okay, perfect, Elsie. Now, can you help me with the last part? Uh, let's see, Henry. I, I don't know if you are there, Henry. So maybe you can help me with that part. I now finish. Now I terminate, teacher. Okay, let's try. Intentémoslo, Henry. Let's okay. try. We have to use, vamos a hacer las preguntas, only the questions. Y le vamos a pedir a, veamos, a Suleima quizás, o Manuel. Si nos ayudan with the short answers. Okay, let's okay. do letter B. Okay, Henry, primero, the question. ¿Qué vamos okay. a utilizar? What are we going to use? Do or does? Do. Do. Do class. Right? We are going to use do. ¿Por qué do? Why do? No, uh, thousand. No, estamos en, las, en la tercera parte. Okay, okay. The okay. questions, right? Um, questions. questions. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, Letter B. Ajá. Tiene el B. Exactamente. Sería do, right? Do classes start at 8 on Tuesday? ¿Y cuál sería la respuesta? Empieza. Yeah. Uh, uh, mm. Veamos el calendario. Let's check the schedule, okay. right? Las se comienzan a las 8. Uh -huh. No. 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 Entonces, eh, ¿la respuesta? Eh, eh, do. No. No, no, no. Eh, no, Dalsen. Uh -huh. Recordemos que para hacer respuestas tenemos que utilizar el sujeto, ¿verdad? Entonces, como estamos hablando de las clases, vamos a utilizar they. No, they don't. No, they don't. Um... Estamos hablando de las clases, es plural. Ok. okay. Very okay. good, eh, Henry. Let's... Continue with the next one. No sé, can you help me, Suleima, with letter C? ¿Cómo nos quedaría letter C? Question and the answer. Uh, the letter C mm -hmm. does the students study at a more school. Okay, we have the subject, the students. Mm -hmm. Si tenemos un plural, we have to use do. 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 Si no tuviéramos esa S, sí podemos utilizar el DAS. Okay. Do the students study IT at Mark's school? ¿Y cuál sería la respuesta? What is the answer? Uh -huh. ¿Será que ellos llevan esa materia? Yes. Yes. Uh -huh. They do. They do, that's right. Okay. Thank you, Suleima. Okay, continue with letter D. Can you help me, Manuel? Maybe, Manuel, can you help me? Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. Go ahead, please. Uh -huh. uh, does, does Mark go to school on Friday afternoon? Perfect. And the answer? Mm, sería no. Mm -hmm. He don't. He doesn't, perdón. <laughs> okay, no, he doesn't. That's right. Okay, and the next one, maybe Oscar. Is there Oscar? Can you help me with letter E? Do mm -hmm. they have any time for sport? Okay, perfect. And the answer? Yes. They do. Okay, for the tiempo, we are not going to finish, but solo quería dejarles. Uh, si podemos compartir the answers in WhatsApp, uh, so I can check the others, okay? 
So you can share from letter F, G, and H. Solo una tarea les quiero dejar, just a homework. Uh, I'm going to share with you this part. Okay, I want you to choose five questions and write the answers based on your opinion, right? Tomorrow I will ask the task so you can share and practice the speech. Okay, if you don't have questions, guys, no sé si hay dudas, voy a compartir. I'm going to be sharing this activity too in the WhatsApp too. Okay, no sé si hay dudas or questions. No? No. Questions? Okay, perfect, guys. No nos olvidemos completar las secciones, right? De acuerdo a las fechas que les compartí al inicio de la clase. Okay, guys, thank you so much for coming. Uh, have a good night and see you tomorrow. No nos olvidemos de hacer la tarea, okay? See you guys. Thank you, teacher. See you. Have a good night, guys. See you tomorrow. See good you. Night. Good night. Good night.